Donlin has a core value proposition that says happy, satisfied employees breed happy, satisfied clients, and their technology solutions enable both their employees and clients to be more efficient managers. One of the things about Donlin that has really uh, impressed me over the years is the focus hasn't really changed that much. Uh, one of the core value propositions that the company runs under has always been uh, take care of your employees, happy, satisfied employees, breed happy, satisfied customers. And although there are a lot of changes in the industry relative to technology and reporting and electronics, uh, green initiatives, uh, customer service always needs to be there. And that's been one of the mainstays of Donlin uh, for, for many, many years. How do you measure your customer service? Do you your customer service achievements, do you uh, survey? How do you, what do you do? Uh, two primary methods. One is uh, we do, uh, twice a year we do a survey of all of our customers. Uh, so it's not uh, how well are we doing from our perspective. We try to take the perspective of the uh, customer base into consideration. And then for the last uh, five or six years, we've actually done a lot of work going outside of the industry looking for third party validations of exceptional performing companies. Uh, one of them being the International Association of Outsourcing Professionals, where we've uh, consistently moved up in the ranks every year over the last five years. I believe last year we were 34th on their list, and that's for all companies. Uh, other great brands like um, IBM and uh, Apple, I believe, is on there. Some very, very good names that we're very proud to be associated with. Um, how do you... How do you uh determine what good customer, what does good customer service mean to you? It's really uh, being able to provide the solutions for the customers individually. Uh, one size doesn't fit all. Uh, just having a call center that answers the phone the same way for every customer and not building intimacy for them doesn't really build that um, stickiness with the client base. We try to form solutions that are customizable for each of the customers. Uh, the goals and objectives for each company and each fleet department or fleet manager tend to be pretty unique. And we've tried to maintain our flexibility and our systems, our reporting, and our method of delivery for each of those customers so that their individual experience is exceptional rather than just trying to say, hey, we've achieved certain metrics across the board, across all customers. It really comes down to satisfying each customer individually. What do you think makes Donlin stand out? You know, I, I'll answer that from the perspective of our clients. Uh, they tell us that, we, that we've done over the last few years five things especially well. Uh, the first is, you know, although you know, many other companies have experienced some financial instability with the recent uh, financial crisis we, we just are coming out of, hopefully, uh, we really didn't have that big of an impact on our client base. We had plenty of capital, plenty of liquidity. Uh, our rate structure was uh, set up in a way that we really didn't have the, the drastic swings in financing that were out there in the marketplace. Uh, the second p pillar, if you will, on top of that is the customer service platform that we just discussed a moment ago. Throughout that period, we've actually enhanced and added our cap in capabilities and customer service. Uh, the third is um, really kind of it's in the center of these five points intentionally. It's our technology capabilities being able to design and implement technology solutions for our clients and for our own employees internally to make both of us more efficient in managing the day-to-day -day of an individual fleet or in our case of managing, uh, assisting and managing the fleets for our customers. The fourth would be strategic consulting where we're actually able to take all of this data that we collect in our data platform and bring it back to the customers in a fashion that they can actually develop uh, ex executable uh, plans to take cost out and save money in their organization. And then the fifth, which is probably the newest, but one of the more exciting, are our green solutions, uh, which we have a couple of products that are, that are pretty unique in the marketplace uh, that is uh, becoming more and more important in corporate America today.